What's going on guys, welcome to Facebook Ads Friday week 18. If this is your first time tuning in, every single week we take a look at two very successful and proven Facebook ads. So these are Facebook ads with millions of views, thousands of comments, but the best thing about both of these ads are they all still current and working right now. So in this video, we're gonna be taking a look at what products they're selling, what their ad creatives look like, what their Shopify store looks like, where we can source their products, the sort of profit margins they're making, and ultimately just see what sort of things we can learn and implement to improve our own businesses. So if you're watching this video and you still haven't found a product for your own business, you're about to see two great options. And if you want two great options every single week, then make sure you subscribe to the channel. Any questions or anything I can help you with, post it down below. I will read it and I will respond to you. Thanks for tuning in guys and let's jump straight into Facebook ad number one. Before I play this creative for you then, how do I know that this is proven and it's working right now? I'm gonna draw your attention to the comments section or more importantly, the actual ad copy at the top. So we can see that it's got nearly 40,000 reactions the post started on November 24th, so it's only been running one, two, three months-ish. It's got 8,000 comments and 16 million views. Just to back up that it is current and working right now, if we take a look at the comment section, so this is the newest section, we can see a comment from one hour ago, two hours ago, four hours, eight hours, nine hours, 14 hours, a significant amount of comments all within the last day or so, which just indicates this is still current, this is still being ran as an ad because people are seeing it and people are commenting on it. By this point, I'm hoping that you're agreeing with me by the fact that it is a proven product. However, let's just kind of double down on that or double check and check out what people are saying about it. So Becca here at the top says she loves her Willow Vine best Facebook purchase ever. So that would indicate that she's bought this product. Natalie here says that she bought it and she loves it. Penny 13 hours ago says she bought one of these and she really likes it. Jenny here from one day ago says she's got hers and it looks awesome. Tia from one day ago says she ordered one, she received it, she hung it up over her bed and she absolutely loves it so there's plenty of people all within the last few days that have indicated that they've bought the product and most importantly they love the product as well enough talk then let's take a look at the video creative so I'm going to keep the audio switched off for this um, but what is good is that every single word this person is saying is in the subtitles at the bottom and because it's flicking between different colors and it's going through kind of like the script it naturally keeps people's attention because it keeps flicking between different scenes as well again that resets people's attention and it keeps them watching the video the other thing they do really nicely the strategy they use is obviously UGC content there's a real person here talking about the product with that iPhone or some sort of camera in front of their face talking about the product it builds social proof and also that natural kind of interest with viewers. When you see somebody talking, especially in this kind of format, naturally you kind of want to hear what they have to say. So when I was designing my house, I wanted things that are unique and different, not basic. Um, like you see in every single home decor store. And then what she actually does here is it's such like a natural way of filming it. She literally has the camera on her laptop or her computer showing the actual website, showing the link that people will click and where it will actually take them and it actually shows them how to make a purchase on the website so again it gives off that real impression of this person has actually gone through this process and done this and because people have seen the website and they've seen what it looks like they've seen the price of the product when they actually get onto the website they'll feel subconsciously just a bit more comfortable because it's almost like they've been there before or they've seen it before and therefore it'll look similar after she's shown people how to make a purchase it goes through a few different shots showing her face smiling enjoying the product i'm just talking about different features and benefits and also the different places in which she's been able to put it so anybody watching this is going to pretty much um, cover all basis one other thing that she does as well um, so that in fact there's another thing there which i've just missed so my go-to gift so it gives people examples or reasons um, for buying this product the other thing she does as well which is for all different rooms in the house that's why I got three. So she's telling people that she's bought three. Whether she has or not, I don't know. Maybe she has. But again, it just kind of gives people that idea to buy more than one of these products, which is going to bump up that average order value. Let's now take a look at the store that's selling this product. Um, to be honest, over the last kind of few months or so, I've been spending less time focusing on my actual stores rather than I have my creatives because when somebody when you actually think about it in the process and what people are actually thinking when they see your ad and they go through that per process of wanting to purchase a product by the time they've clicked on the Facebook ad they pretty much want the product otherwise they wouldn't click on it they certainly want more information so the better your ad creative 
can do the job of selling the person on it and giving them all the information they need, then the higher your conversion rate is going to be. And the reason why I'm leaning more towards that way and spending and focusing more time on creators rather than the actual product page is because getting somebody to watch a 30, 40 second video talking about the product, showing how to buy the product, showing reviews of the product is gonna be so much easier than getting somebody to spend 30 or 40 seconds reading through a product description. So the more information or more questions you can answer in the ad creative, then that's gonna translate into more people buying your product. And I think these guys are adopting that same kind of approach as well, because just scrolling through their product description, you've probably seen it's actually quite a short description. There's not actually that much information there about the product. So it's one, two, three, four, very small paragraphs. And one of them is actually not about the product at all. It's about money back guarantee. In fact, two of them is it's not about it. That's not about the product. That's about buy a light, plant a tree. And then they have a FAQ section, nice, short, sharp, to the point. So customers can very quickly get all of the information that they possibly need to feel comfortable to go on and actually buy this product. Let's have a look at numbers then. We're talking profit margins now. And we saw that Enchanted Willow Tree selling the products we go back to the top for 40 pounds. They're running a 50% offset so maybe they do typically sell it for um, a bit more expensive. Here's one of the first supplies I found on AliExpress. It's not an easy product to find, to be honest. Um, this one is called Gem GOT Party Time Store. If you want to check these guys out, definitely do a bit more research than I have in to try and find the best possible supplier for this. But as you've already seen, you can buy this product for just over £20. They're selling it for £40, which leaves in and around sort of £18 after you've had to pay for shipping as well um, in terms of profit per sale, of course, minus any expenses acquiring that customer too. What is good about this supply though is it comes with that fast shipping delivery commitment delivery in 15 days and so that was product number one then guys i hope you're enjoying the video up to this point we're going to get into product number two in a second but before you do i just want to very quickly mention the free training that i've got um, in the top comment of the video description down below it's basically a naught to launch in your business in 21 day um, action training 100 percent free anybody can check it out won't cost you any money um, i think you'll really enjoy it it is one to two hours long so make sure you block out some time bring a pen and paper and as a thank you for watching it everybody who does watch it um, will get a free copy of of my PDF of 194 profitable product ideas just like this one. So make sure you check that out when you've got the time and let's jump straight into Facebook ad number two. Okay, so Facebook ad number two is from a company called Team K9. If you wanna check these guys out, um, it's a relatively new ad and yet it's built up a pretty decent amount of engagement. So Saturday, October 8th of 22, so give or take four, maybe five months. Um, and what you see is what you get basically is just a one single static image ad. Um, it's not a great ad to be honest. That's really why I wanted to show you this because you can make money in this business even if you do kind of cut some corners I'm not recommending at all that anybody do this I just wanted to show you this so we can take away the actual important things out which is they've got a product that people want to buy so as you can see it's quite clearly photoshopped with some dodgy effects and some dodgy like treat kind of photoshopped into this pocket it is branded with their logo in the bottom left hand corner but ultimately it's probably a stock image maybe they've put it together themselves maybe they haven't they've put like a galaxy in the background you can see where they've like cropped out the windows and it just doesn't look very good at all but at the end of the day it has 7,000 likes nearly 2,000 comments and over 1,000 shares as for newest comments then so one hour five hours eight hours 11 hours 16 19 22 21 one day one day one day one day one day one day two days so as you can see lots of people commenting on it all within the last sort of 24 hours or so which just goes to show they're still spending money on this so it still must be working in. We can see there are some positive comments from people too. So love mine keeps the babies safe. Judy here says so far so good, especially now with melting snow and mud. I think this is a great product if you're going to be drop shipping to the UK or anywhere who's going through their winter months. Uh, my targeting for products like this would be this exact type of breeds. Large dogs, long haired dogs that are going to be bringing loads of water and mud um, and dirt into the car definitely that's going to be where your biggest requirement is i think that's why things like this do so well too it's because on facebook you can be super specific about the types of dogs that you target you can actually narrow it down breed by breed so you could split test literally every single one see which one works best and gives you the best return and then just narrow down onto that let's take a look at the shopify store then um, they've gone for like a keyword approach to the product name which is interesting they've got the phone number at the top which is a nice touch because because it kind of gives that sense of legitimacy to the business. Any business that's trying to scam people probably won't have a phone number, or at least from a drop, drop shipping kind of 
perspective you don't see many scam stores with phone numbers so it kind of gives people that sense of security that it is a real business in fact let's just check out their footer see what they've got in their footer so based in the united states they could put their address there just to kind of double down on that social proof or that professionalism element however they're obviously making money given the amount of comments and engagements um, that their facebook ad has so they've gone for a keyword approach not my typical go-to or recommended they have this shop pay option to allow people to split it up into four interest-free installments which is a nice touch i think things like that are going to become in more and more um, popular um, and in demand given the kind of climate and recession we're about to go into as you can see it's not a cheap product at 90 dollars. it's not a cheap product at all we'll take a look at a couple of suppliers in a second see what we can source this product for as we move down i'm not going to spend too much time on the product description to be honest because as you can see it's quite messy it looks quite spammy um, but it just goes to show if people have enough of a demand for a particular product and they trust the store that they're buying from again going back to that point of getting people to leave positive comments and reviews in the Facebook ads, that's where people will get that trust from. Anybody can import 382 reviews onto, um, onto a Shopify store. People will have seen this review layout time and time again now. People have cottoned onto it. People are no strangers now to knowing that they're, they're a bit more savvy consumers. They know that anybody can fake this sort of thing. Whereas if you have loads of positive comments from real people, you can go onto their profile and check that they're real people to make sure that you feel comfortable when it's a legitimate business that you're buying from. Let's take a look at some suppliers then. So we wanna find one that has these pouches like this one. Um, so this has a 15 day on time guarantee for 33 pounds. So what's that, about $45. That's probably why they're having to sell it for um, was it 80 or 90 dollars it was 90 dollars because it's an expensive product to buy there's another one here which looks kind of similar for a similar price and as i keep going down there's not a lot more to see to be honest so i'm going to base it on this one 33 pounds uh, with free shipping i'm going to call it say 40 dollars they're selling it for 90 let's call that 50 dollars. so you're still looking at a good 40 dollars profit per margin which leaves you a lot of room to acquire customers for which is probably why they're able to get away with such a amateurish dare I say it or spammy um, product description because they can afford to pay anywhere up to kind of like 40 maybe even 50 dollars um, per customer and so with that being said guys I'm going to wrap the video up they're the two products I wanted to show you in this video I hope you enjoyed it I hope you stuck with me um, any comments questions suggestions anything like that post them down below I will read them and get back to you if you want two new product ideas every single week like I mentioned at the beginning of the video make sure you subscribe to the channel and please do make sure you check out that free chain and I promise you'll enjoy it it's 100% free you got nothing to lose Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next one on Monday. See you Monday.